Hello everybody, Darkrush67 here with another um, ranked compilation for you guys. This is going to be my, uh, it's actually my third one right now. And uh, yeah, I have another commentary for you guys. Um, primarily what I wanted to discuss in this video was, in one of my previous videos I talked about um, the subject of rage quitting. And I got a little bit of, uh, actually quite a bit of hate for that. Well, not hate, but this like dislike about it. And I kind of, now that I realize and I look at the, now I look, now that I look back at what I said, it was kind of probably irrational, and uh, like, probably not really the smartest thing to say. But uh, hey, we're all human. We all make mistakes. Uh, so I, I just wanted to inform you all that I do take back what I said about rage quitting. In fact, I don't really care anymore. I don't rage quit anymore. I kind of really don't care because I kind of already proven my point about it. And I don't really need to um, rage quit because like, I don't really care. I mean, it's just a game. And I, I, ba I basically, like the real reason why I wanted to enforce it like was because a lot of people that were getting, there was a lot of people getting spammed and um, uh, and I felt kind of bad for them, and some of them were my friends, and they were trying to just play the game. But like, you know what I mean? They were getting, they were noobs and guineans that were getting raped by freaking Tsuchikage spammers and so on and so forth. And they couldn't beat them. And anyways, so I'm just, I, I, I kind of encourage it for their sake. But anyways, now I take it back on all levels. I don't want, I don't suggest or don't recommend anyone rage quitting at all because it's not, it's nothing. Uh, fun uh, for anyone. If you if, if you do have to rage quit, like I don't suggest this either. But if you're going to, if you do want to, just to be a dick and keep your record at a sh at a good level, um, then I suggest you do it like after the game, like after the KO sign. Then after that, like people, we won't have to like we won't have to suffer from it. You know what I mean? Like we won't have to get the loss, and you won't have to, we won't ha we won't get the win, and you won't get the loss. Don't be a sore loser. It's a game. Uh, win or lose, uh, don't be a freaking dick about it, so yeah, anyways, um, so yeah, these are just, uh, that's one topic I want to talk about during this video, second topic I want to talk about was, in this video, uh, I have a couple of ranked battles, actually a couple, um, two versus spammers, uh, well, a couple PTS Lees, and I just I was just using uh, some new teams on ranked because I use just about everyone on ranked. I, I like to challenge myself with uh, generics. I always challenge myself with generics because generics. Uh, a lot of people say generics have advantages, but um, not really. But because most generics, in some way, they're flawed. So I don't really know how to. I don't like to be honest. It's not really. Uh, because a lot of people say generics all oh, like teams with names that just give you extra freaking bonus when you're U3. Well, yes, in a sense, but not. But the, the, like for example, the the um, the supports you pick can aren't necessarily useful compared to like Tsuchikage, PTS 1010, um, Masked Man, Pain, Hidan, like. It, generics is like like what I'm using with Neji right here. Um, Kiba with um, PTS, no, sorry, uh, Takasasuke, which makes Leaf Peers. And it, it, yeah, it gives me a bonus. I always look for the bonus too, because the bonus, in a sense, kind of gets, gives me a little bit of an advantage, but also puts me at a big disadvantage because I can easily pick PTS Neji and use like Hidan, uh, sorry, I can easily pick Neji or someone and simply just put Hidan on guard and then Tsuchikage on attack and just spam my combos and attempt to win. But if I play like this, it's a little bit more challenging. Um, my mind is more open to it. I get, uh, obviously, it's, it's a little bit more creative and it shows, obviously, a little bit more skill. So for those of you who think that this game does not take skill, uh, well, you're wrong. Everything takes skill. It's just, that's the way it is. I don't care who you are, what you think. That's just the way it is. Um, Anyways, so yeah, and I like using generics because it's a little bit more challenging than picking uh, PTS-1010 and Hidan on guard all the time, you know what I mean? So yeah, and uh, yeah, like I was saying, in this battle I have a few spammers. Now, recently I've been... I, I took out... Recently I, I started saying, like, I had a, a discussion with some friends of mine. And they, they told me, like, I, I was just... Anyway, I was playing a friend of mine on... 
It all started when I played someone on ranked, a friend of mine, and I thought he wasn't going to spam me or, like, you know, fag play me or whatever. But it turns out that he did, and he ended up spamming, like, the grab, which which is fine. I mean, like, I, I'm not going to... You, you play how you want. Well, now, like, when back then I was kind of pissed, because, like, why would you friend spam your friends? Like, for example, the name, Ra the name is Ray's. Uh, this guy right here, he's a friend of mine, he's actually in my clan, and he's actually pretty good, and I'm pretty sure he has a channel, Williams Brett, maybe you know him on YouTube, and yeah, I don't like to, f no matter who you are, like, if, like, among my friends, I really don't like to, to play gay, like, I don't break your sub, I don't break your shield just to U3 or U2, U, I, I like to, like, you'll see in a moment, I'm pretty sure you just saw that I broke his shield and then I just comboed him like a good friend. But uh, some people, um, whatever. I just, I just do that. To, two things: one, to give myself a challenge, because I like to get better, and two, to obviously out of sport, out of good sportsmanship, and out of good, out of like friendly, out of a friendly, as a friendly, I don't know, what do you call that? As a friendly gesture. There. So yeah, and as I was saying, uh, recently I played a friend, and all of a sudden I had, I was kind of ticked off, and then my friend started telling me, "Oh, it's Jen. He bought his copy." Kind of like the same argument about um, that I had mentioned about uh, rage quitting. Like everybody bought their own copy and they could do whatever the hell they want with it, which is true in a sense. But at the same time, it's kind of flawed. But whatever. In this in this sense, um, I, I they got yeah he's right. He got his own copy. He can play however he likes, which is fine. And I agree. Uh, I, after a while, I kind of said okay, fine. I agree. And uh, yeah, so that's about it. Um, it started with, uh, anyway, so I was just saying, it started, I got a little ticked off at that, but then I said, then they said, oh, um, it doesn't matter, it's only Jen that's broken, play, play how you think, like, on ranked, play to win, I mean, I like to play to win, because that's what I usually aim for, I play to win, but I don't play to win with, like, anything possible, you know what I mean, like, I don't try hard to the max with masked man or pts conquer or freaking tilt spam you for the whole game just because i want to win and get points no i like to have fun while i'm winning i like to get be given a challenge while i'm winning and that's why i use generics that's why i use characters that are underused and then i get i always get excellent battles and that's how i'm able to post them on here for you guys so yeah anyways and then after that after that little discussion with my friends i said they said um who okay, uh, play how you want, it's it's your game, you get to play however you want, so I finally decided that, you know what, now if I meet a spammer on ranked or someone with a ridiculous record, I'm not showing any mercy, I will pick my masked man, and so far I've gotten quite a few rage quits with him because people have a hard time beating him. But other than that, I'll play regular players, and I'll even try to challenge myself, by, as you see here, by fighting PTS Lees, or maybe even PTS Nedges, with characters like... PTS uh, Shikamaru or PTS Sakura or whatever. Anyway, anyone that's like not necessarily used by the general public, you know what I mean? Because then it gives me more of a challenge and it's exciting when you beat someone with, uh, you know what I mean? So yeah, anyways, uh, that's that's about it with that. And as I was saying, my point to that was that I started using Masked Man again, and I probably uh, I, I I used to use PTS 1010, but I only used her combos because I thought her combos were pretty awesome. But then people like started getting mad for calling me a spammer, even though I didn't use their, their uh, combos throughout the whole game, like, you know what I mean? I didn't use her, sorry, her spam throughout the whole game, but anyways, whatever, I mean, some people hate me, gonna hate, and that's just the way it is. But anyways, yeah, um, and I have a couple spam videos, so that's the point, yeah. Uh, I'm gonna be, you, you, I posted two videos, one versus JCD, uh, he's a top player, he's got like 3,000 wins and 12 losses, and like 5 rage quits, all, almost all the time. And he's always picks PTS 1010, Suchikage, and Mass Man. Those are his like top three. J dash C dash D was something, whatever, something like that. J C D something or J C E D, whatever. Anyways, my point was um, that guy. Uh, I played him and I got him on. I played him with my Mass Man because I figured all oh, this guy's gonna scrub and he's not gonna do one combo. And it turns out he didn't do one, so I picked Mass Man and I predicted that he wouldn't. So, uh, you'll see how that turns out later, and I, I, okay, I'll fine, I'll be honest with you, I dominated the guy, and I didn't even spam, I'll be honest with you, I used, uh, Masked Man's ultimate, uh, not ultimate, you won once, or twice, I don't remember, and yeah, and, uh, that's, that's, that's how much freaking uh, these guys suck, and to be honest, I was actually disappointed, as I, I could have freaking owned his ass with, like, Akashi or something, you know what I mean? 
But oh well, maybe next time. And then I have uh, one more spam battle at the end, uh, around the end versus a Tsuchikage. Now this guy literally, literally, literally all he did, <laughs> I laughed, I was dying of laughter, was spam the triangle circle button. And he did it so many times that I, I was, at one point I was unable, you're going to see, at one point it took out like a whole bar of health. <laughs> And I still won in the end with an epic, epic win. And that's exactly why I posted it because it was a pretty epic finish. And I still beat him. And I had like like literally 5% left. And because it took out a whole freaking bar of health, his stupid rocks. I, at one point he was freaking throwing rocks at me and I saw like 400 on the map. And I was like, whoa, 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 stupid sub bar. Why you no sub? You know what I mean? And yeah, so anyways, I ended up fighting this guy, uh, that guy. And it was pretty cool. Now I'm obviously, obviously fighting Kibas because they're a bunch of scrubs with their hacky combos, hacky combos. And then they complain when I beat them with combos, and they complain with Itachi, really? Itachi's combos are some of the worst ones in the game because it's so close range, um, but, and hard to hit. And they're pretty long, actually, Itachi's. But anyways, uh, scrubs are gonna be scrubs, haters are gonna hate, that's just the way the world is. And yeah, and then I have, I believe, oh yeah, and then I have a match, I believe it's right after this one, this uh, Kibo one. Uh, what I, f I found a guy, I was playing on ranked, and all of a sudden this guy joins my lobby and his name is Darkcrush21. And I'm like, lol, you, like, you could imagine how funny that was. And his record was actually pretty lame, I, I would have expected it to be a bit better, and I, and I wasn't sure 100% what his record was, but I'm, I know he had one, 1 out of 10 when I met him. And I said, oh my god, and his first character was, believe it or not, PTS Nedge. Wow, whoop de friggin' do, OP character with combos for the win. And then I played him, and you're gonna see, and like literally, I used, I didn't even use someone that overpowered. I used PTS Shikamaru. I mean, come on. PTS Shikamaru is like, he's okay, but he's not that amazing. His combos are a little bit weird, and his grab too. But, anyways, it was, it was a fun game. I kind of destroyed him in a sense, so I'm, I'm sorry for the spoiler, but uh, I kind of little destroyed him, and. Anyways, it was kind of, uh, anyway, I was like, uh, if you're gonna impersonate me, at least do it right, you know what I mean? Anyways, I guess uh, people are getting uh, unoriginal with their names. I actually just found out, uh, by the way, speaking of which, the other day I just found out that there's another Kill Sasuke haters, except this Kill Sasuke haters is a Japanese account. So if you find Kill Sasuke haters hating on you, and it says G J P uh, JPN on his name, uh, it's not the Kill Sasuke haters we know from any North America, okay? So don't worry about it, guys. Um, it's not him. Like, he warned us all, actually, which is kind of scrubbish because I hate people who steal names like that. It's kind of frustrating. Uh, I know some people made uh, spirals. They strolled spiral a bit. And, uh, yeah, so anyways, uh, <laughs> they trolled spiral a bit and they made a few games for him. But, yeah, anyways, uh, I guess that was trolling. It wasn't necessarily trying to be annoying but it, like some people are really really annoying like dark crush 21 really next thing you know we're going to be seeing spin uh oh like spin 10 or something you know what i mean dan d casillas or maybe even his p his xbox account name on here it's not going to be dan you know what i mean anyways so i'm kind of uh try to be original with your names uh even my alternate accounts my names are pretty original i mean only one of the two uh is uh actually uh just the, my dark crush name but with a different number because it was for my it's my youtube one but that was the one i did on the side like when i was bored in storm 2 i don't really go on e i don't go on both either of my alternate accounts anymore because it was, i was only doing it because i was bored and i wanted to get some ranked points after i got to max rank bp and dark crush 67 i got in i got in in my almighty penis account and then i got it in i almost got it in my uh, dark crush 17 account but i didn't end up doing so but it's okay because then gens came and now i'm s i'm obviously not gonna play on those two on the ranked because it's like 900 million bp and that's really like no i'm, I'm not even going like past i'm probably gonna go 11 million and then that's it and then i'm probably i just once in a while i pay for fun like i said um i'm not sure if i mentioned it but i started playing custom rank recently and oh boy the level of butthurt on custom rank is hilarious I literally just played a foe before and he had like a general, he had a, more wins than losses. He had 245 wins and 200 losses, something like that. The thing is Kizame and I was playing as PTS Kakashi. Now, I know what you're thinking, PTS Kakashi, you're going to spam that shit No, actually, all I did was, I even chose generic supports. I chose um, Obito with Minato, right? 
But uh, I was winning, and then all of a sudden he just started, and what I had forgotten to do at the beginning of the battle was choose the right items. I was like, shit. <laughs> I forgot to choose the, you know, the items there, that uh, the custom items. But, because my custom items are made for, not to fag, but just in case someone fags me, but I forgot to put them, so I ended up, I was winning, then all of a sudden with his keys in me, he just runs away, and then when he sees an opening, all he did was, uh, Sleep tag, ultimate. Sleep tag, ultimate. And then he won. So yeah, that's the kind of frustrating things you'll encounter on custom ranked, which is kind of annoying, but whatever, at the same time. I mean, whatever. You know what I mean? It's not... I guess it's... Like, you thought... On, I'll be honest with you. You guys thought ranked was bad? <laughs> ranked is nothing compared to custom ranked. I mean, Kudos to those who are trying to play, like, kudos to those, like, Daddy D who are trying to play legit in freaking custom. Like, yeah, yeah, I'll play legit for the first five minutes, but the rest of my items are all faggy items. Okay, what the freaking... If someone tries to screw around with me, I'm playing to win on rank. That's it, sorry. If it's friendlies, it'll be a different story. But I don't think you do. I don't think you do friendlies. I'm not 100% sure about that. But anyways, yeah. That's, that's, that's about it. -ish. And, uh, yeah, that's, uh... That's about it, I guess. Oh, yeah, um, no, 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 I don't know, whatever, that's about it, yeah. And, yeah, that's, uh, that's about it, guys, uh, me owning this Mass Man Spam who fails. Yeah, you see, it's never over till it's over, because he had, like, green health, and then I owned his ass with, like, the same amount of health for the whole game. So, yeah, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video, I hope you enjoyed the commentary, if you have any questions, comments, and or, uh, thoughts on what I should do. Oh, look at that, there's the, there's the Dark Crush 21 guy right now. And if you have any thoughts, questions, comments about what I should talk about in my next video or what I should do in my next video, uh, please don't hesitate to write it in the comments. Like the video, please. It helps me to know how many people are actually paying attention to this and actually watch it. So it gives me an idea how frequently I can, you know, uh, post videos. If, if more people like it, the more videos I'll probably post. And yeah. Thumbs up to obviously come check us out. A lot of our pro, a lot, a lot of us pros are at valorgaming.com. Um, I hang out there along with many others. Dan comes to hang out there sometimes. Adika, um, Spyan is a mod there, so if you want to have a chance to talk to Spyan, he's there too. Um, Spiral comes once in a while as well, as well as people like uh, Dark Sprit, uh, Suge Corp, and uh, Legend, which is Jovernal, Ninety. Uh, a bunch of pro players, um, and I just recently found out today that the Storm community, the French Storm community there, they joined the they joined Valor Gaming. So that's pretty cool. Yep, that's that's about it, guys. Have yourselves a great rest of the week, and then a great weekend. Hopefully, um, I'm really I'm Italian, so I'm hoping for Italy to win tomorrow versus Germany, uh, and if not, viel Glück Germany, and uh, good luck to Italy, of course. But anyways, uh, yeah, and I hope, I'm hope, I don't know if the game is done, I'm 100% right now, Portugal versus, uh, what's it called, Portugal versus uh, Sp Spain, but I'm really, really rooting for Spain to win. But anyways, that was a side note, just a different, uh, different uh, subject. So yeah, guys, uh, have a great week, a great weekend, uh, and that's about it, signing off. Alright guys, take it easy.
疲れたぜ。戦闘開始おいたろどうだ俺のお気に入りのくぐつは。戦闘開始
敗者にかける慈悲はないお前はここで終わりだ戦闘開始やりすぎて壊れてしまったかな戦闘開始どうけ
敗者にかける慈悲はないお前はここで終わりだ。やりすぎて壊れてしまったか。
やりすぎて壊れてしまったから。